Hello, every pony. Well, recently, like five and a half or an hour ago, um, I put out a video that said um, uh, that you could ask me questions, and this is just going to be part one of the questions I have so far, so you can ask me more questions in the comments or wherever. I don't know. Um, so yeah, ask me in the comments in this video or the other video, doesn't matter. So let's get on with the questions. This is not a question, this is a demand, and it says, play the Luna game now. So I talked to Wolfie on Kick, and I'll make an entire video about that, playing it while she's in a Skype call with me, so. Yay! Then there's also this. Do you know the love of my life? That's a, that's my question. It should be very easy. Yes, I do, and it is munching orange or Ariel. That's a great name. And now more. Now from Jesse Reed. Do you like Doctor Who? I don't know what that is. I know it's a show, but I've never watched it, so. Do you like the Warrior series? If so, who is your favorite cat? Yes, I do, and I'm still trying to finish it. My favorite cat would be Squirrel Flight. I don't know why. Squirrel Flight or Leaf Pool? I have no idea. Or Holly Leaf. I have no idea, but, uh, yeah. Um, if you were stuck on an island, who you who would you bring with you? I don't... I'm trying to search through all my friends who can cook, clean... And do whatever. Alright, I would bring the lightning tumble. I don't know why. I like cooking. I think she does. She could probably clean. I don't know. Eh. Who's your favorite pony? It's more of a tie between Pinkie Pie and Twilight Sparkle. Could you start playing games on your channel? Yes, I'm going to start doing that, hopefully. I have no idea, though. Maybe, maybe not. I don't know. And then also by Jesse Reed. And also, you have that Marome video. Do you have a fanfic? And if so, could you read some of it? Ah, oh, great. Here we go. I'll read. Uh, I don't want to read right now, but I'll read the chapter I just made. Uh, Alright, I'm going to go and grab that chapter. Alright, here we go. Mitch's point of view. I woke up tied to a chair, and Jean and Jerome were talking. Jean came over to me and untied me. Then untied Jerome. She told us to follow her. She led us downstairs and out the door. We got into her car, and she drove to Skye's. Mitch, are you alright? Jerome asked. Yeah, but I'm just a little so confused. He nodded. We got out of Jean's car and said hi to Adam. Then went to the room me and Jerome were staying in. I sat on the couch. Jerome sat next to me. I put my head on his shoulder, then fell asleep. Jean's point of view. I got back to Allison's, and she looked at me mad. Hi? You let Mitch and Jerome escape. She walked closer to me, and I kept walking backwards until I was in a corner. Why did you let them escape? I... I... She hit me on the back of the head. I fell to the ground in pain. You! I shouted at her. She kicked me in the arm and left me there in pain. Lily stared at me, then walked away. Jerome's point of view. Mitch fell asleep on my shoulder. I picked him up and laid him on the bed. I went to the phone and tried to call Jean. She didn't answer after five times. I ran out the door. I asked... Sky, what way her car went, and she w was heading to Allison's. She was most likely there already, but I got in my car and drove down there. I was scared to go in there. I snuck in, and in a corner, I saw her. Her head had blood on it, and she was passed out. It looked like she had been crying. I picked her up and drove her to Adam's. Adam was gone, and... So was everyone else. I went to the living room, which was right by me and Mitch's room. I put her on the couch. 
Mitch walked in and stared at her, terrified. What happened? I don't know. Mitch walked to me and grabbed my hand. We walked over to our bed and just laid there, waiting for her to wake up. After about an hour, I heard a footstep. Mitch was asleep, so I got up and saw Jean looking at me. Do you need anything? Yeah, some help. She looked at the door, then someone knocked. I opened it to see Allison. What are you doing here? I could be asking Jean the same thing. Jean walked up to her and slapped her. What the heck? Don't be so innocent, you little... I My phone rang. Just get out of here. Allison lifted, listened and left. Then I answered my phone. Be happy I read that to you. Now I have a bunch more questions to go through. Okay, so Flash asked, On a scale of 1 to 10, how much do you like Name Here? Now, you're probably wondering, who is Name Here? His name is Eli. Eh, um, 6? Thing is, in all my crushes, I've never thought about, like, kissing them or something. Just like, no... No, thank you. Just like you. All right. Thanks. What is the grossest thing you have ever eaten? Sushi. I didn't even have to think about it. Just sushi. What is the weirdest dream you've ever had? Probably. I don't know, because I don't remember my dreams that much. Uh, let's try to remember one. All right. So I had written a fan fiction about me, Jerome, and Mitch, and then some other people, and I had dreamt about it with a twist ending where everyone had died. Yeah. How did you come up with your pony name? I took a survey. It said Dream Dancer, I think, but she was a Pegasus, so I changed like everything about her. I don't know. Uh, there's no number five, so number six. Did you notice I skipped five? Yes, I did. Number seven. If you had to be a toucan, then eat a duck while skydiving into a lake, and the elephant was in the middle, and the lake was made out of rainbow puke, and then got turned into an elephant and died for a second, and then started flying with anvils following you, and then noticed that you were being by aliens who were pink and wore those weird fake fa face nose glasses thingies and turned back into a sukan with with a duck what would you think um i was super drunk and stuff and i i i've been watching too much youtube and that I need help, serious help. Okay, so, um, ask me more questions in the comments in this video, or the video where I asked for questions. I'm going to have to answer them if I just answered all that crap, so. Yippee! I'm so confused. It's normal to be confused, right? Because if it's not, then... I need serial help. Serial help. Well, I'll see you all later, and don't become a toucan that had to eat a duck while skydiving to a pool of a lake of rainbow puke and then turned into an elephant and then died for a second and then pink aliens with weird glasses and noses. Uh... Uh, two cans? Right, bye. I'm so confused.